robot or a queen? I don't want to be a robot. Queen is better because I can command people. Wait, where's my crown? I chose to be queen. I'm the queen. Why are they telling me what to do? You have to complete all the tasks in order to be the real queen. But I don't want to wear my clothes upside down. It's embarrassing. You have to. Otherwise, you should have chosen to be a robot. All right, mom. I hope no one sees me like this. Why are you wearing your clothes backwards? I have to so that I can become queen. You should have chosen a robot like me. But that's going to be really hard to do. It's not that hard. How? I haven't even met him. Sarah, do you know where the palace is? Why? I want to meet the prince. Don't expect the prince to come out of the palace for you. Then how do I make him fall in love with me? Send him a love letter. Okay. Do you think it worked? Yes, it worked. That means the prince likes me, right? What? How? I almost got kicked out of school for being stupid. There's going to be a sudden test today. A sudden test? But I haven't even studied. Hurry up and do it now. Yes, sir. I hope my score will be the highest. Amara, your score is 20. Did he just say my score is 20? Oh my gosh, that's really low, sir. Please let me fix this. Actually, your score is the highest. All kids got zero. Huh? Yes, finally. Three tasks completed. I heard the fourth task is the hardest. Really? If you fail, you can die. What? What? I wonder what my next task is. I hope it's not too hard. Mom, what are these planets on top of my head? You can choose where to live. Jupiter will be our new planet, so please choose Jupiter. What's wrong with Mars? I'm just gonna choose Mars. Okay. Mom, I'm leaving. It's already late. Did you choose Jupiter? It's very important you choose Jupiter because... Yes, Mom. I chose Jupiter. That's good. When you're back, pack your stuff and get ready. We'll be moving to our new planet soon. I chose Jupiter. So did I. Hey, why is everyone going to Jupiter? Because scientists say that it's safe to live there and it's much bigger than Earth. There's much more space. What happens to the people who chose Mars? It's forbidden to choose Mars. But I chose it. Whoa, you guys who didn't choose Jupiter will regret it. What's wrong with Mars? Sir, can I ask you a question? Yes. Why does everyone choose Jupiter? Why not another planet? Because Jupiter's more suitable for humans, according to the scientists. Are you a scientist? No, I'm just a researcher. <sighs> Only a few seconds left and I'm all alone. Wait, you're not alone. I also chose Mars. Actually, we're both safe because Mars is. Wait, you're not alone. I also chose Mars. Actually, we're both safe because Mars is. Because Mars is what? Wait, I'm already here? Yep, welcome to Mars. If you have any questions, please let me know. Amara, there you are. What were you trying to say before we got here? I was trying to say that Mars is more suitable for humans. It's more likely we'll survive here than in Jupiter. Wait, I want to ask. If Mars is more suitable for humans, then why did everyone choose Jupiter? Because researchers and scientists want to experiment with them. They sent them there to see if the planet is actually livable, which is not. Then what should I do? My whole family chose Jupiter. I need to help them. Okay, I'm coming with you. Let's go there now. Okay, you ready? Yes. Okay, you ready? Yes. Why does it say error? We have to find a black box. Black box? What black box? I don't know, but without it, I don't think we can enter Jupiter. Where should I look? I don't even know what's on this planet. Calm down, I'll help you. Just give us a clue. Huh? What does this clue mean? What clue? Green grass? Let's look for it. Have you found it yet? <sighs> no, it turns out Mars isn't how I imagined it to be. It's not similar to Earth at all. Don't give up, we'll find it eventually. Where even are we? Let's try find it on Google Maps. Google Maps? Really? Is there even internet here? It's worth a try. Yep, you're right. No signal. What are we gonna do? We've been walking around for two hours. Wait, isn't that green grass? I can see the box. Let's get it. Hurry. <sighs> Why is there a wall? What's going on? Why can't I get in? Solve the word puzzles? If we want to enter, we have to solve the word puzzles. I mean, it's only three letters. How hard could it be? Okay, um, let's try O. Yes, it's right. Do you have any guesses? Try E. Okay, E. That's wrong. 
L Y U How many mistakes can I make before I get a consequence? I have to be careful. Okay, my next guess is... Wait, miss, before I leave, let me show you what's inside my bag. Well, hurry up. Oh my gosh, there's a lot of money in here. <gasps> that means she's not poor. Please give me the money. Amara, don't listen to her. Give me the money. I need it more. Amara, why is there so many people outside our house? It's because of this blue bag, mom. You need to hide it. You're embarrassing. That's me. funny, actually. You still don't know what's inside of this bag, do you? Oh my gosh, money. I'll give you some if you want. No, that money isn't yours. Return it to its owner. Amara, everyone loves you. They said they want to make you the queen of the city. What? Why? Because you're the richest girl in the city. Today's your coronation. It's true what Arya said. This bag really is a blessing to me. Now, please, make your way to the palace for the coronation. Now? Dreams really do come true. Yeah, don't forget to bring your bag. Mm-hmm. Hello, it's time for you to return the bag to me. But I don't want to. This bag is mine. But you promised. You can't change your mind now. Oh, my gosh, I forgot. But this bag is mine. You don't have the right to take it. You'll regret not giving it to me. We'll see. Okay, keep the bag. Amara, everyone's waiting for you. Wow, I can't believe everyone loves me. Now, it's time for your coronation. Is that the crown? It's so beautiful. You decided not to give me the bag, so now you have to pay the price. What? What does this bag mean, mom? You'll get a free bag, honey. Free? Yes, it will consist of three colors. Black means rich, pink means ordinary, and blue means poor. Then I hope I get black. Three... Two, one. <gasps> Why did I get a blue bag? You should never wear that bag. I can't believe I got blue. I mean, just look at your house. It's so ugly. Obviously, you're going to get the blue bag. What color did you get? Black, because my family is rich. Bestie, what color bag did you get? I got pink. What about you? I got blue. Oh my gosh, blue? Yes. Why are you shocked? Because you're the only one who got blue, so you're special. Special? How? That means I'm the only poor person in school. No, that bag will be a blessing for you. But I feel like this bag is going to bring me a lot of bad luck. I'm just going to throw it away. Goodbye bag. I hope I get a new black bag. Amara, I heard you got a blue bag. No, miss. I haven't gotten a bag yet. Miss, she's lying. No, I'm not. Anyway, before school finishes, you have to show us your bag. But I threw the bag away. I have to find it. I threw my bag here, but it's gone. Are you looking for this? Hey, that's my bag. Give it back. In one condition. You have to return the bag to me tomorrow. That's my bag. Why should I return it? Fine. See, I knew she was lying. You have to leave the sea immediately, Amara. Why? Because no one here accepts poor people like you. Why does my bag suddenly feel heavy? Come on, please leave. Wait, miss, before I leave... Let me show you what's inside my bag. Soulmate wants to eat? What does this mean, mom? This is the activity that your soulmate wants to do at the moment. But you have to give him permission first. Oh, I get it. Of course I'm going to allow it. He has to eat something, right? Of course he does, honey. But if he asks permission for something strange, don't accept it. Okay, mom. You don't have to worry about your future son-in-law. My soulmate goes to school? That means he's more or less my age. Do you think he goes to the same school as me? I can't wait to find him. Hi guys, I'm controlling my soulmate's activities. Whoa, cool. What did he do today? He asked for permission to eat and go to school. What did he just ask permission for, Amara? Uh, nothing. I just looked up. Are you sure about that? Didn't he ask for anything? Nothing came up. Next time, tell us, okay? Does that mean my soulmate's a criminal because he wants to kidnap someone? I heard your soulmate's misbehaving. No, mom, it's not like that. Anyways, I refused it. If he continues, I won't let you have a soulmate. Don't be like that, mom. I don't want to be single forever. So prove to me that he's not a bad guy. Huh? He wants to buy a lipstick? That must mean that he has a girlfriend. Now that I've rejected it, I'm starting to think that lipstick was for me. That means he wants to meet me. I have to tidy my room so he doesn't think that I'm messy. It's a good thing my mom's out of the house. This is my only chance to meet him. 
Honey, who are you waiting for? Mom, didn't you tell me that you were going out? Mom, didn't you tell me you were going out? Do not open that door. I'll go and open it myself. Wait! This is my chance. Amara, there's no one here. Thank God he escaped on time. My soulmate wants to sue? I mean, that's a good thing because my clothes are always torn for some reason. That means he's perfect to be my future husband. Hey Amara, why are your soulmate's activities? Why does my soulmate always ask me to kidnap someone? It's better you just leave it and don't think negative. But he wants to commit a crime. That's very serious. Oh, he asked to go to an orphanage. He definitely wants to do charity. Oh, I'm so jealous of you. You seem to have a nice soulmate. My soulmate wants to go to a doll shop. There's only one doll shop in town, right? Because my soulmate's activities were weird from earlier, I'm going to go there to meet him to see what he's really like. It's 10 p.m. Do you think the doll shop is open? I suggest you don't go there. The doll shop has been quiet for a very long time. What do you mean? Just trust me. Okay, I'm at the door shop. I think it's still open. I have to open the door on the count of three, two, one. Is there anything I can help you with? A simple house or a luxury house? Who wants to live in a simple house? Of course I'm going to choose a luxury house. Wow, this house looks like a palace. Honey, what have you done? How come our house looks so luxurious? I got the option to choose between a luxury house and a simple house. And I chose the luxury house, mom. Whoa, this way I don't have to be ashamed anymore if any of our neighbors decide to come visit. Do you guys want to come mines after school? Of course, your house is so luxurious. I wonder what Amara's house looks like. I've seen it. It's really disgusting. Hey, what are you guys talking about? Why are you talking to us? What did I do wrong? You are wrong because you're not rich. Let's go, Jenny. What? This year, our class sleepover is going to be at Jenny's house again, okay? I don't mind sleeping at hers. Her house is beautiful, unlike Amara's house. Guys, don't you want to come to my house? I'm having a birthday party there. In your smelly house? <laughs> it sucks. I don't want to come. I don't want to come either. It's dirty. But my house is not as old as you think. Don't lie. I've seen you go to your house after school. It looks really dirty. Enough. All right, Amara. I'll give you a chance. Everyone's going to your birthday party, but if your house is what everyone's saying it is, the sleepover will be at Jenny's house. Okay, sir. I understand. They'll soon know the truth, but I have to get ready before they come. I wonder what the reaction will be like. Oh my god, that must be them. I can't wait to see Jenny's reaction. Hello, guys. Whoa, is this really your house, Amara? Yes, sir. This is my house. I can't believe it, sir. I saw her once go home after school, but it wasn't to this house. Amara, is this really your house or are you lying to me? Of her? course not, sir. This is my house. Why would I be lying? I don't believe her. She doesn't want to admit that this house isn't hers. This house is too beautiful to be Amara's. Okay, I'll give you 24 hours to prove that this house is really yours. And if you can't prove it, the sleepover will be at Jenny's house again. Okay, sir. What happened, honey? My classmates and my teacher think that I'm lying about this house being mine. But why didn't you prove to them that the house is yours? How can I do that? You can show them the contract of this house, but the contract is still with your dad and he's overseas. So I have to wait for him to come back? My teacher only gave me 24 hours to prove it, mom. Your dad's coming home tonight. Don't worry. All right, mom. I'm going for a walk. I'm so angry. Of course that house is not Amaris, but she won't admit it. But if it's true that the house is hers, the sleepover will be there every year and not at your house anymore. Of course not. She's lying. I've seen her house. It's not the one we went to today. My dad's not home yet. Honey, I'm home. Dad, finally. Did you have the contract for the house? Yeah, your mom told me you needed it, right? Here you go. Thank you so much, Dad. This is going to solve all my problems. It's almost been 24 hours and Amara still hasn't proven that the house is hers. See, sir, I told you she was lying. If she doesn't prove it quickly, the sleepover will be at yours and she'll get kicked out of school for lying. I'm sure the house isn't hers. I have to show them. Sorry I'm late, sir. Did you bring what I asked for? Jenny, why did she come to school? I thought she wouldn't come because she doesn't have proof. Yes, sir, I brought it. Here you go. Good, now let's see if the house is really yours. Oh my god, so that luxurious house is really yours, Amara? That house is really Amara's? Yes, see, sir, I wasn't lying about the house being mine. Jenny, are you ready to leave school? Amara wasn't lying. 
I'm sorry, sir. Please don't kick me out of the school and keep the sleepover at my house. Because my house is still more luxurious than Amara's. Jenny, the sleepover was at your house last year. Your house is really luxurious, but Amara's even more. But that was last year, sir. My house has changed. It's more luxurious now. Okay, students, let's go to Jenny's later to see the current state of our house. Okay, sir. Sir, can I go too? Of course, Amara. All students in class can go. I'm sorry, sir, but I don't want Amara to come to my house. What? Why not? You went to my house too, and I didn't care about it, even though you called me a liar. It's my house, and when I say no, it means no. Why doesn't Jenny want me to go to her house? What does she have against me? I feel sorry for you, Amara. Even though I'm friends with Jenny, I'm sorry. You don't have to feel sorry, Olivia. You know what? Just come with me to Jenny's house. If she says anything, I'll take the blame. Okay. Hey, Jenny. Hey, Olivia. <gasps> Wait, why did you bring Amara here? Oh, come on. Just let her in. You feel sorry for her, don't you? Do you want to get removed from our friend group? No, Jenny, but... Hey, what's that noise? Can you guys stop fighting? Amara, come on in. Whoa, your house has changed a lot. Yes, sir, I hope you like it so that the sleepover can continue to be here. Okay, I've made my decision. This year's class sleepover will be at... Uh... Oh, your house has changed a lot. Yes, sir, I hope you like it so that the sleepover can continue to be here. Okay, I've made my decision. This year's class sleepover will be at... Uh... Jenny's house. As I expected, because my house is better than yours. But, sir! Okay, everyone, get ready. We'll meet at Jenny's house tonight at 8pm. One more thing, sir. I don't want Amara to come to my house. But I'm also a part of your class. When I say no, it means no. Amara, don't make this a big deal. Just listen to Jenny. It's her house after all. Okay, sir. How dare Jenny not let me go to the class sleepover? Why don't you just go regardless? Well, it's easy for you to say. You're Jenny's best friend. And if you really liked me, you wouldn't even go to the sleepover. You know what? You're right. Why don't you replace me at the sleepover? replace you but won't jenny be angry she won't be angry because if there's one less person she won't be able to do the sleepover oh i see thanks olivia you're welcome what are you doing here i said you couldn't come plus there's no one here yet what happened to your house i don't know i just got here and found it like this someone must have came to mess it up it was you wasn't it me what no this whole place is a mess. What am I going to do? Jenny, we're here. Open the door. Do not even think about it. I'm going to count to three and you have to open the door. One, two, three. I don't even know if that's useful, but okay. Good morning. Morning, mom. I made you pancakes. <gasps> Thanks. Actually, I'm not feeling hungry. I'm feeling a bit sick. Are you sure? Just eat one at least. No, thanks. Hey, Amara. Hey. Oh, one second. My mom's just calling me. Aren't you going to answer? Um, no. Anyways, let's just go to class. Okay, class. You're free to go home now. Hey, you want to come mine? Nah, I need to go home. I have a lot of homework to do. Actually, I can just do it at yours. Let's go. Hey, you think I can sleep over tonight? Yes, of course. Amara, your mom's downstairs. She says she wants to talk to you. <laughs>